guys, welcome back to Rooster Model Channel. How are you today? Part number seven. Seven. And uh, I think it's awesome part. Uh, today we will uh, focus on the interior. I will try to do my best uh, to show you many things today. I think it will be a very nice video. We will make the flocking powder with uh, some paint and uh, some uh, flocking powder by Hero Boy. And uh, also we assembly some of the part of the interior. I will show you how to handle with alpha model kits. I know that many of you all the time struggling a little bit with alpha model kits. I am here to help you Rosa model channel sunny day, Friday again. Let's start, enjoy. I will give my tip and relaxing. Uh, very good uh, video for you guys that uh, want to make uh, details to this amazing interior. We, we will do it today. So let's start. That's it. Okay, so guys, I am happy that you are here. I want to show you something, uh, the, the, a few things that I do without you, like uh, put the logo on the wheel. As you can see, I had the logo. It's a metal, uh, uh, metal uh, transfer uh, decals. I also had the template, same as the roof, and I had the carbon fiber on the dashboard and paint some uh, area in uh, silver and also in red as you can see we will make the decals over there also over there I uh, uh, paint uh, sorry I created decals for the carbon fiber area and also at the shifter over there as you can see and it looks fantastic uh, what I do more it's just add the decals over there of M4 if you can see it and it looks fantastic I uh, put the uh, pedals over there and uh, also over there I just paint a little bit and uh, put the decals on the multimedia area uh, and also I uh, create a carpet from a letter it will be sit on uh, the interior after that and that's it more or less uh, about here we will come back here but first we will start with the flocking okay guys I have it here, yes. Do you see this area? I won't make this area in a flocking powder. I have it here for me, Hero Boy. I have many colors. They have in the web many color flocking powder. It's a powder. And uh, you will see first uh, what we will do. It's masking this area, just this area, because we don't want on this area a powder. So what we will do first is take one masking tape, piece of masking tape and put it over there like a pro as you can see I put a very accurate inside all the remains will uh... now what we will do is prepare everything make the uh painting over there and after that the flocking and I will show you the tools let me prepare everything lift up little bit the camera that you can see everything and we come back to you guys okay guys so we are ready uh, to make it what I use this wonderful the paint XF1 it's an enamel paint by Tamiya and also a brush a big brush and what I will do now it's put paint in a, a thick way okay a lot of paint and after that we will take the powder with this amazing tool and start put it on some box okay let me first of all put let me mix it little bit shake it yes I don't need too much okay what I will do dip it in the paint and start put all over the place guys you see what I'm doing? Use a lot of paint because you want the, uh, the powder go inside and stay. Okay, everybody see what I'm doing? Amazing. Let's take a little bit more. Everybody see, yes, I know that you see. Okay, 
after that uh, enamel paint uh, take time to cure so we have time to do it like a pro okay guys so I will leave this area I put it I close the bottle of course because I need to I need I need it okay what I will do I will put it inside I will take the flocking powder I want black flocking powder and I put it in my tool over there okay I will take a little bit and put it inside and now all you need to do is play with it I will bring it and you will see how I create the carpet I know that I have many videos that show how to make it uh, if people know, to know how to make it you can uh, take it forward and uh, see wonderful thing how I add the details to the interior you can play with the flocking inside shake it little bit it will move Just verify that you put on all the places Do you see it guys? Locking powder, it's create a carpet and it's fantastic Okay, easy? Now put it inside, let it cure I don't know, one hour? Let's say one hour We will put it inside You can put the material back Close it, clean your area, and let's make more things, guys. Let's make more things because I know you like it. What about decals? What do you think about making decals? Let's make it, guys. Okay, do you ready? I want to add the decals over there and also for the multimedia, and I will show you how to make it. Let me organize everything and we will do it, guys. Okay guys, let's continue. First of all, what I will do is put these two decals in the water. In the meantime, I will glue two parts. What I will use, a bobsmith uh, gold. I will put a little bit on piece of paper. Why I do it? Because I have more accurate with the toothpick. I can put over there a little bit and take this piece. Put it inside, as you can see. We have first steps guys, I know that you like this dashboard. Okay, one of here is the multimedia, I put a little bit inside, I need a little bit glue over there and take this wonderful piece with my hand and put it inside. Everybody see? Okay, first steps guys. Now let's put the decal and I hope they're ready. It's take time, but yes, let's see if the decal moving. Yes, they're moving. Okay, what we will do now is put it inside, guys. Inside, I will push it and take a cotton swab and start play with it inside and to verify this is in place. I have it here. Tum, ta, ta, tum. And remove the water a little bit. This is look okay to me. Hope so. Hope so, guys. Everybody see? I will take the multimedia and put it also over there. Play with it to the place. Delicate work, but worth all the money, guys. Okay, let's remove the water. I will 
bring it to the center a little bit. I want it in the center, please. I love the OB design decal. You know, Alpha model it's uh, part of OB design. The decal are also awesome. really good. Now let's use the fan a little bit. see dip it with little bit microsol guys why because i want the curves will be good also let's take the curves and uh, shrink it bend it little bit i love it so much i'll show you something on the indicator you will not believe Long video guys, long video. Wait for it. Okay, so yes, I have the decals. Everything look okay. Everything look amazing. Take your time guys with the decals. Don't rush. Look what I'm doing. I hope that you can see, yes, sometimes the reflection of the light and things like that. But it's awesome, awesome, guys. Now let's make wonderful thing together, guys. Do you see this wonderful piece from small gray details? I want to put one of them inside the indicator. So let's do it together. You will enjoy to see it. If you want to buy it, it's uh, from a uh, small gray details, as you can see over there. What I will do, I will use two bigger. As you can see over there, I cut them like that. In the shape, one and two. Okay. Now, what I will do, put it over there and put this over there and let's take two smaller one I think this one no maybe this one will be good yes smaller one guys for the small indicator I don't know if you can see it oh my god it's so small okay yes I have it what I want to do is put it inside okay put it inside so what I will do I will hold one I will hold one and put little bit, put little bit on this piece, little bit micro a uh, Bob Smith gold, and try to be accurate to put it into place. No more, you will see it. Yes. Awesome. Do you see? Inside. <laughs> awesome. Do you see the difference? It's great. Uh, wonderful uh, reaction. And uh, it looks very real and nice. Do it. Do it, guys. Do it. In modeling, do everything. It's all the fun. Okay, let's take the other one. Put it like we want it. The other one. Lift it a little bit up. Yes. Okay, let's take the smaller one. And after that, I will show you what I'm doing. Smaller one over there. Sometimes it takes time, yes? Remember it. 
<laughs> it's so small. But handle, handle, handle with the small parts, guys. You will not regret. Stay there. Yes, let's see. Okay, let's take the other one. And put it in the other place. If you think it's easy, so try it and see it's not, but it's worth it, believe me. It's worth it and you will see. See how much it's uh, making the, uh, the indicator so real. That's why I love it. Focus camera! I want to show them. Do you see it? Amazing. Indicators. Now, the real thing, guys. The real thing is create the glass. And how I create glass, I use Bob Smith epoxy in five minutes in, in two variations. Let's take new paper and you will see what it creates because we want a reflection. We want a reflection on the indicator. I put a little bit over there. It's a 50-50. It's going to be awesome. Okay. I put the 50-50 a little bit, as you can see over there, and I mix it first. You will see it. You will not believe. Okay, now let's take a little bit and first of all put on the multimedia, because we want to create a screen on the multimedia over there. Do it like a pro. Yes, we have it. Do you see the reflection on the screen? I think it's awesome. Okay, now let's put the indicator inside. Only in the circuits that we are made. It's a bit over there. Little bit in the other one. Just look. Do you see the reflection? Do you see how much is beautiful? This is what I want you to do, okay? Meantime, you can. Uh, Use this epoxy for uh, put one more parts and also the uh, steering wheel over there. Take it like that, put over there and push it. Okay, and take the wheel guys. Take the wheel. If you have glue, use it. Don't throw it. Okay. Put the wheel, verify this is in the center and you love it. Yes, mine in the center, what do you think? Guys, I want you make things like a pro. Okay, now it look very nice and very real guys and very very real. I love it so much, you see me how I make it and uh, go try it at home, okay? This is the first steps, let me organize the next steps for you and we continue. Don't forget guys, small great details, make the work. Uh, so guys, yes, okay, the flocking powder is cure, I also put the carpet, I glue them with Bob Smith and now let's put the pedal over there. As you can see, we need to put the paddle. 
Okay, over there, let me bring the light and you will see better than me. Okay, what I will use, a bobsmith again. I will put little bit on piece of paper. I will take little bit with a toothpick. I will hold this part, the leg rest, as you can see. I will put little bit under and glue it. Right, super easy. Over there, as you can see, this is the leg rest. Okay, bring it to the place and let it dry. Okay, let's the, take the pedals. We will put little bit over there. No need too much. Nobody see it. Okay, hold it and put it. Awesome guys! Do you see the pedal? Oh, Yaniv, how you make it? Okay, the last step is put the uh, pedal of the gas, the fuel uh, pedal. I will put little bit inside and I will try to hold it and push it inside. Try to find a place. Awesome. Okay, we have it. You can all the time check from below if it's inside or not. Definitely inside. Okay, now let's uh, put the seats. As you can see, I make uh, seat belts over there. What you can do is use a little bit uh, black and paint some of the area of the seat belts, the latch. Create more realistic look. Everybody see what I'm doing? More realistic look, guys. Okay. Now, after that, let's put the two seats as they show us over there how to put it. What I will do, I will take the seats that I made. We make this interior very simple and nice in black. I don't want to make it in red or in brown and things like that. Very simple. Let's put it, verify this is go inside before we put the glue. Okay. And now what I will do, I put over there glue. As you can see, I put little bit glue on all the corners and glue it. Super easy. And what I can do, it's turn around and verify this is going inside. Okay, now you can wipe off the unnecessary glue and hold it for a couple of minutes, couple of seconds, yes. And also, let's do it again to this part, to this seat, and go inside again, lift it. Verify this is going inside and clean the remains. Oh, the other one fall. Come back here. The other one fall. Yes, come back here. I need more hands. Who can help me? Who will help me? Let's hold it together and verify this is going inside. Yes, guys. Everybody see? Very good. If it's moving, wait a couple of seconds and it will glue, believe me. Just also verify this is in the center because they have a little bit gaming. <laughs> Look guys, super nice interior, definitely for BMW M4 and it's going to be crazy, yes? Okay, the uh, 
more thing that you can do to add details is for the uh, seat belt buckle. For the seat belt buckle, I use a, a, some kind of a red X7 by Tamiya. I use a toothpick again, put a little bit, and just paint buckle inside. Everybody see? Add the details, guys. Add details to this amazing car. Also for the back, a little bit. What do you think? <laughs> awesome! Okay, guys. Uh, here, I think we finish this interior. Let's make a test fit. It perfectly this why I love uh, the alpha model it's fit, fit perfectly but I'm all the time ensure it okay here we have the uh, the door what I will do I use a, a seat belt over there I have this material uh, I think uh, I take one of the piece and uh, show you one together with me I think it will be awesome guys it's a long video we won't finish the interior and uh, I want that you enjoy. You remember that Alpha model sent us uh, this material? It's a kind of uh, create uh, the uh, seat belts from them. I not use it, I use a real letter, uh, uh, how it's called? A real cloth, a pure slick. This is the name. If people want to see, the light can help us. Yes. Everybody see what I'm using, a 2 millimeter. And also they give us, where is it? Yes, they give us uh, some kind of uh, seat belts, yes, uh, buckles over there. Okay, and I will show you what I'm doing. First, let's take one of this. I will use a knife. I will take it out. This is the uh, older for me. Okay. Let's see if I can do it, everything okay. This is the older, why I need it? Because I won't. It's fall down. Okay, let's take another one. It's all from the floor and I don't see it. Sometimes, yes, things can fall. Keep attention. But I have here one more, so I have a problem. Let's hope it will not fall. Okay, what I want to do with it is make create the a holder over there. Okay, I no need all this uh, long uh, one. I will cut it definitely. But this is the holder for the silvers. Yes, let's say it like that. And then when you put it inside, you can glue this one. And after that, put this one. You understand? And then after that you will come with the panel door, put it inside, put it inside, and then you have the holder for the higher spot over there. I will do it and I will show you, okay? So first of all, it's created very nice and very unique. I will glue it. You see I bend it for the shape of the door. I will take a little bit. Bob Smith and put all over the place and then I will glue it okay awesome okay this is the first step that you need to do and after that just verify this is come off from this area on this area okay awesome do you see it inside come directly nobody see it from here awesome the second step is take one of these amazing uh, seat belts buckle take it out okay for the people that won't know I, I cut it like that in in a shape and then it's more easy to put it inside okay 
You see? Very easy to put it inside. Small detail works. Remember that company, yes? Okay, now what then I do is cut this area. And then glue it to this door. How's home? Let's cut it a little bit because it's open. And then let's put glue on the panel, on the, I call it the mount. You can call it anything that you want. And then take this and glue it. Everybody see? <laughs> Everybody see what I'm doing? And now, when I put it upper, it will be awesome. And you will see it. Let's put a little bit glue over there also. Clean the, clean the remain. And just glue it in the same way. And cut the remain, guys. We have a seat belt little bit higher and then look how much amazing is going inside and see it perfectly do you see it guys everybody see it try that you will see it very good now let me make one more uh, and uh, we connect everything together also the dashboard and everything and uh, I know it's a little bit long but we're almost finished guys Okay guys, so yes, we're ready for the uh, uh, complete interior and install it in in very unique way. Uh, Alpha model kits, I uh, all the time find myself uh, struggling to put the interior, but I will show you what I'm doing. Before we will close everything, the uh, last uh, video for uh, uh, how it's look like from outside. This is the interior and this is the dashboard and it looks fantastic with all the indicator inside guys. Do it, please do it. And also the panel doors with the seat belts and everything. So first what we need to do, I will take it a little bit out and I will show you something that you will not forget. Don't forget people, put the mirror. We have the mirror, huh? yes, as you can see. What I will do, I will put a little bit, again, my favorite glue with toothpick in the center over there. I will put a little bit more, as you can see, and put the mirror. I will try to put it in the center. Yes. Everybody see? I already paint in black inside and it looks fantastic guys. Okay, we have the mirror and now it's good time to show you to put the dashboard before everything guys. Okay, first glue the mirror, uh, the uh, dashboard inside. Okay, so what I will do, I will put a glue over there and I will put I will put it inside. Everybody see, try to put it in the center because we need to leave a gap for the panel doors. Everybody see? Very good. Now, what you can do is let it cure a little bit and tell me some jokes. <laughs> I'm joking, yes? Let's continue. Let's put the panel doors, okay? The panel doors sit inside before everything, so what I do, I love to put inside a little bit glue, like that, and like that, on both sides, and just be accurate, remember, this area, it's supposed to sit perfectly in the place, okay? 
so don't make a mistake hold it a little bit yes exactly okay everybody see be accurate put it inside I will hold this one and also this one. Oh, you need. Put it in the right place. You not see nothing, I know. I'm also not seeing. Okay, I can do it. Okay, one side is thick. Now it's more easy to do the other side and try to bring it also to the place yes like that I hope that you can see sometimes you not can see everything but I will try to do my best also but it's not glue let's see why we need a little bit more glue over there and put it again yes this is cook okay to me why it's not gluing usually bob smith uh, we need to hold that little bit maybe Okay, now it will be cute. Maybe it's better to put glue under here. Okay, yes, guys, we have it. Everybody, see now, all you need to do, all you need to do is push this inside. Okay, and I will show you. Super easy guys, super easy. Everybody understand? Any question? Any question? I am here to help you, to make it right, to make it good guys. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I know this was a very long video, but uh, people, if you want to make it, like that you know how you have all the full video of the interior in one video and I think it's awesome I don't want to split it I want you to see everything on the next steps we will handle with the disc brakes the wheels the shock mounts and everything I will connect everything together and it will be awesome guys so have a lot of uh, waiting I know until next Friday but I try to do my best to make with you more video and more video and don't forget join to my club guys join to my club we start wonderful project over there and you will be happy to see it so have a good day enjoy and uh, see you soon bye bye cross the model channel we all bleed the same sun. Oh,